guys, Jeff the Nature Guy here at Zoo Montana with Jake and Goliath. Oh, but I can't forget about this young lady right here, our newest keeper. And you have a good story because you just started volunteering. Next thing you know, we're like, hey, you want a job? And next thing you know, you're a keeper. So That's you, good. Yeah, so That's I, good. That was pretty good. <laughs> so tell me a little bit about yourself. Why the zoo? Why are you here? Well, I was a technician for nine years, dogs and cats. Want something different? I dig the wildlife. So, so bigger start here. Wait a minute, technician for nine years. Did you start being a technician when you were four? I am 27. That <laughs> amazes me. This she looks good for 27. Pretty amazing. I age well. Yeah, yeah, you age well, which is always a good trait to have. Now, listen, I, you, you said you were a little nervous about this, but I got to tell you, I'm more nervous than you because I've got these two horses here. <laughs> Everybody out there knows horses. They they kind of scare me a little bit, so I'm I'm a little sweaty here. And it's not you. It's it's these horses. But now, animals. You love animals. Where did you get that passion? Where did you do you remember the moment you uh, thought animals are what you wanted to do for your your um, career? Basically, since I can remember anything. Okay. I grew up with a bunch of animals. Nice. Parents had animals. Fish and wildlife was involved in our life. So, yeah. Awesome. Fantastic. You know, and that always starts with the parents. I tell you, the parents are such a, obviously, crucial for a career development. And, and right. a lot of time, that's a big part of it. All right, favorite animal here at the zoo? What, what do you love working with so far? I have to say, my spirit animal here is the beavers. The beavers. Okay. I dig it. Sleep till three, party all night. <laughs> there you go. That's a pretty good lifestyle, right? Yeah. There, of course, the three of them that we have. And so right now you're working in the ed department, correct? Right. And yep. and uh, so you're working with a lot of the education animals, obviously interacting yep. with a lot of people. You enjoy interacting with the guests? Yeah. There's a lot yeah. of fun people here and yeah. obviously the kids. If you had one thing to tell the kids out there about finding your dream job in your career, what would that be? Um, I would say just go for whatever you like. Don't dream big. Dream big. big. I love that. <laughs> and and don't be intimidated by horses, right? Right. I mean you're just standing there like a pro. This thing this the giant beast is trying to eat your face and you're you're not even worried about it. He knows better. I mean this is the we nicest one and I'm terrified here. <laughs> well hey, it's a pleasure to have you. I, we're excited to have you here at the zoo. Thank, Thank you for you, being Jeff. a keeper here and I hope you uh, have a long career in the animal field and I hope most of it's here at the zoo. Yep. Awesome. Sure will be. Well it's been a pleasure. <laughs> Guys, until next time I am Jeff the Nature Guy with Amanda, our newest keeper. We'll see you at the zoo.